step up a little closer. We can't all stand way back there because a lot of this stuff, in terms of chef collection at least, and even some of the others, are kind of touch and feel type things. So what we've done is we've really taken a lot of these touch points and put a lot of quality and premium into them. I don't know how much you got into this one. Not a fork, not much, so perfect. Um, you saw the whole collection. This is the refrigerator. It's a T-type design. So this is kind of a new platform. Samsung launched a model called the T9000 last year, which has sold and done really well. This is the same type of platform. This is the largest freestanding refrigerator you're gonna find. It's gonna be rated at 34 cubic feet. So it's really, really big. But all of this stuff in it is very functional too. When you interact with it, it's a little, well from that angle, it's hard to see. Can you see the numbers up here? Can you see the display up here? When you're away from the refrigerator for a while, that goes away. So very, very premium look, very clean look. The features that you're gonna to need to interact with every day are still here, but we've taken all the temperature controls and these other things that you don't change every day, and we moved them down here to the door so that you have this beautiful aesthetic on the outside. Sparkling water, which is an innovation that Samsung brought out last year. It's on some more models that we'll look at down the way. Familiar with this? Not familiar with sparkling water on Samsung? Okay, so an innovation that we're bringing here uh, as well. Beautiful from the outside. I think when you open it up, it's a, it's a huge wow. So here's the inside, and it's like nothing you've ever seen. And this is when you kind of need to step up and come up a little closer. Um, we've got metal cooling in here, and you'll see metal cooling as a theme that Samsung's introducing as we look at some other models this year. What's metal cooling? What does it do? Well, I think everybody understands metal gets cold and stays cold. And what you want in a refrigerator is kind of consistent temperatures. So the feedback we got from the chefs was consistent temperatures is one of the things they need for good food preservation. So what you've got is the metal holds cold, and so you don't have as much variance from the top to the bottom and as you go around and cycle through the, the different stuff. One of the neat innovations here is called a chef's pan. Did they show you this one over there? Yes, no, no? Okay, so perfect. So chef's pan, what is it for? Uh, you can put food in here, you can marinate in here, Okay, that's kind of neat, but what you can also then do is take this out, you can put it in the oven, you can cook in it. When you're done cooking in it, you can put it in the dishwasher and wash it, and then you bring it right back here. So, great feedback. You can hang, you can do it. It can hang under there. It comes with two. This model, for some reason, doesn't have two in it, but it comes with two, and so you can also put it in this, which is called the chef's pantry. Chef's pantry different from normal pantries that we've had before in that it goes a little bit cooler. So it goes down to 30 degrees, which is the temperature that the chefs told us they need for doing fish and things like that, okay? All of the touch points on here are very robust. So these door bins, here, you just feel it real quick, right? It's pretty sturdy, it's, it's very sturdy. 